thing. If it's foods, staying away from problem foods, as always. Everything we talk about in terms of degenerative disease, except extra. So if everybody, if they, uh, people who are dealing with accelerated aging or diabetes or degenerative, uh, some kind of autoimmune crisis or whatever, cancer, if they have to be careful with their digestive system, this guy has to be extra careful with his food, uh, his food choices and digestive health and digestive wellness. I'd be eating as little as possible and just focusing on nutrient-dense foods and liquid foods. That means minimizing his intake of foods. If he doesn't feel hungry, if he doesn't absolutely need to eat, he shouldn't be eating. That's just work that his body has to, that's just energy his body has to expend on, uh, on processing food that it's not going to be able to expend on the healing process. So eating as little as possible, but focusing on nutrient density, using vegetables, using smoothies, using juices and soups, vegetable juices and vegetable soups. Bone soup could be this gentleman's best friend. Making absolutely sure he's getting enough protein. I'd be using a gram of protein for every pound of body weight, especially whey and egg protein. If he's eating meat, uh, make sure the meat is organic. Make sure the meat is, uh, uh, is grass-fed. Uh, it's not supermarket meat. He should never, ever be eating in a restaurant. He should never, unless it's a... I, I I wouldn't even. I would never eat in a restaurant if I was him, and I'd be really careful about ordinary supermarket foods as well. So he has to be very careful about the kind of foods he's choosing, and also using nutritional supplements that are uh, building supplements, anabolic supplements, zinc, 50 milligrams a day, vitamin A, 20,000 international units a day. Sip on the Beyond Tangy Tangerine all day long. Use the Z Radical, which has got tremendous healing properties. The uh, digestive enzymes with meals, and then digestive enzymes on an empty stomach that can help suppress some of the inflammation and help help uh, uh, enhance the healing process. You're going to get some vitamin C or he's going to get some vitamin C in the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, but I'd be using extra vitamin C. I'd be taking anywhere from 5 to 10 grams of vitamin C a day. Make sure he's on the Mighty 90. Magnesium can be very helpful along with calcium, maybe 1,000 to 2,000 milligrams of magnesium a day. Uh, use the magnesium glycinate form. That second word after a mineral, as we said before, is very important. It's a very important indicator of how well the mineral uh, will be absorbed. Magnesium glycinate, for example, is a much more effective form of magnesium than magnesium oxide or magnesium carbonate. Uh, magnesium uh, glycinate is found in the OsteoMag product from Longevity. Uh, calcium is always going to be important for everybody. Uh, maybe 1,000 to 2,000 milligrams of calcium. OPC selenium can help keep the infection down, uh, any infections down. Uh, selenium is a powerful immune booster, immune system booster. Make sure he's got enough glutathione uh, by building, using building, uh, glutathione building techniques and acetylcysteine. We're going to be talking about that next week. That's very important for glutathione. Glutamine, we talked about that a lot a couple weeks ago. We talked yeah, we spent yeah, a, at least two weeks talking about glutamine. I'd be supplementing with a teaspoon of glutamine every day. Have him do a smoothie or two every day and weight-bearing exercises. Anything he could do to build the connective tissue and muscle tissue is going to be very important uh, for supporting the healing process. So have him listen to the bright side and, uh, for the next few days. Actually, maybe even for the next couple of, maybe for the next week or so, we're going to be talking about connective tissue and muscle tissue building, and that's all going to be relevant information for your friend. All right, Rose, there's a lot more you could do, but that's a great start. May I, may I ask you a question? How come is it, uh, somebody told me, I haven't spoken to him directly. He, he doesn't live where I live. He lives in another state. How come his voice has changed? Higher or lower? I'm not sure. Just they say I, that his voice sounds weird, different. I, I, don't, I, can't, I, would have to, I can't answer that because I don't know how his voice has changed. If his voice has gotten higher, he may have done something to, to uh, his hormone, his, uh, either his testes or his adrenal glands. Uh, and maybe affecting his hormone production, but I can't tell you unless I hear his voice. i got to move on, Rose. Thanks so much for your call, and thanks so much for your kind words. I always appreciate, appreciate them. All right, Rose? Bye. Have a beautiful day. Thank you, ma'am. All right, uh, let's see if we can get a couple more in real quick. Brandon in Tennessee, welcome to the Bright Side. What is up? Uh, hi, Ben. Thanks. Uh, I was calling about my wife. She always is having uh, issues uh, battling uh, chronic UTI infections, and this one seems to be very bad. Uh, I know she's taking the tangy, and we're on the ESAs. And Here's a couple things for UTIs, okay? Yeah. yeah. Uh, bacteria, probiotics, biolumin nightly essence. Consider it to be a digestive problem. Somehow bacteria is getting uh, uh, bacteri uh, bacterial balance in the body is being thrown off. So with UTIs, I always focus on probiotics, good bacteria, or any kinds of foods that can throw off bacteria. Uh, if he, if uh, your friend wants to have some quick relief, sometimes Lugol solution can work. Sometimes the sugar mannose, M-A-N-N-O-S-E, can work as well. The Z-radical can be helpful for helping with, uh, 
chronic urinary tract infections also. So uh, look for food allergies, number one. Look for anything that throws off probiotics or good gut bacteria, number two. If you want some quick relief, Lugol solution, which is iodine, put a couple drops in water and drink that down a few times a day. Or uh, a mannose, the sugar mannose, M-A-N-N-O-S-E. And then also uh, sometimes people get some good results from the Z-radical with urinary tract infections. Thanks for your call, Brandon. Uh, anything else? I want to try and squeeze one more call in. Do you have any other questions? Thank you. Okay, thanks so much. All right, Lynn, in Arizona, I've got about a minute. Let's see if we can, get, uh, we can answer your question real quickly. Lynn? Do we have Lynn? I don't know what happened. Yes, there. yes. Have hey, Lynn. Lynn, what's going on? How can I help you? Uh, alcohol abuse recovery. How do you do what, what can you do for nutrients? For, nutrients, uh, post alcoholic uh, alcoholism, nutrients you're talking about? Yeah, yeah. B, lots of things. The B vitamin is probably the first thing, and vitamin C. Your water soluble nutrients for alcoholism are very important. Um, uh, B vitamins are used for processing alcohol and for processing sugar, and vitamin C is important for helping uh, prevent some of the uh, some of the negative effects, some of the damage that's caused by alcoholism. I'd be using five grams a day of vitamin C in addition to the Beyond Tangy Tangerine. The Beyond Tangy will also get you some of those B vitamins, but you may want some extra thiamine, and you may want some extra niacin, both of which are extremely important important for helping the body process alcohol. Zinc is important also. Get on 50 milligrams of zinc picolinate a day. Wouldn't hurt you to throw in some OPC selenium. Um, and then stand away from anything that messes up blood sugar. That's also very important. Maybe even the sweeties after meals. That's all the time we have for today. Thanks so much for your calls, guys. Appreciate all your letters and your phone calls, all the love. I'm Pharmacist Ben. We'll talk to you all later, folks. Bye for now. My name is Jessica Armand. I'm an activist, a GCN listener, and mother of three. Our drinking water and food are filled with fluoride and other contaminants that harm our teeth and gums. To protect my family, I created My Magic Mud, an all-natural teeth whitening and strengthening remedy. My Magic Mud is a soft powder that polishes your teeth, reduces sensitivity, and removes harmful toxins from deep inside your mouth. You deserve a bright, healthy smile. Visit MyMagicMud.com and get yours today. That's MyMagicMud.com. It's time to kick some ash because cigarettes have met their match. Smokers are switching to Vaporate E-Liquid by LaSig because when you kick ash, you kick tar and smelly smoke too. LaSig smokes the competition with real people customer service, a seven-day satisfaction guarantee, and same-day fast free shipping. Become a vapor today at LaSig.com, spelled L-E-C-I-G.com. LaSig E-Cigarettes. Kick some ash. Big business has discovered the preparedness market, and that makes it difficult to know where to go and who to trust. MyPatriotSupply.com is owned and operated by patriots just like you. Has the best prices on storable food, non-GMO seeds, water filtration devices, home canning equipment, survival and self-reliance books, and more. MyPatriotSupply.com has old-fashioned values and the absolute best customer service in the industry. Look for the deal of the day, unique affordable survival. Survival supplies that fit anyone's budget. Get same day shipping on all orders and free shipping on orders over $49. Call 866 229 0927. 866 229 0927. Or visit mypatriotsupply.com for emergency preparedness, self reliance, and food independence. Shop with a name you know and a name you can trust. Before it's time to survive, it's time to prepare. MyPatriotsupply.com. 